Hello everyone and welcome to WISRP ladies and gentlemen, what's going to state real play, I'm Mickey Sticky Flowers Jr. Now, just like with Mickey Sr., I changed him up, well I decided to change Jr. up a little, found a better pad that looks more like a kid, more than what that person did, and I changed him up a little, this way it looks like he's got his bug. He's smoking a little bit of uh, weed, you know, because uh, that's that's what that's what mom said I was been doing, and she's right. I mean, I'm skipping school again. I should be in school right now, but I'm skipping school again. But yeah, we're we're, we're gonna go drive around and head out to the county and yeah, drive my new bug around. So let, let's head out to the county, go drive around. Right, we're driving around, we're close to my house where I live and whatnot. We're back out here in the county and whatnot. Maybe I might stop at my friend's house, buy me another joint. Uh, I'll have to see if he's home. I'm gonna go get some gas real quick. Hello. What's going on, man? Hey, how's your day going? Oh, my day's going good, man. How's your day going, man? Oh, it's it's going good. Yeah, that's good to hear. That's a nice car mm -hmm. you got. Mm-hmm. So, so what you been up to today, man? Oh, not much, man. Hey, you like you're, gas? you're getting gas on the floor. No, I don't like gas. I mean, I'll play I, on your car. I like smoking weed. If you got any weed, that's the gas I oh, like. Oh, you you got you got some gas? I mean, I don't got any, but if you, if you know where to get some, I'm looking for some weed, man. Man, I'm looking for some weed too, man. Yeah, I've been looking for weed. I've been asking around, and no one has any right now. Oh, oh, yeah. But I'm gonna yeah. I'm gonna keep looking because I want to find it, man. I want some weed. I want to get high, man. I want your car, man. No, man, this is my car. Oh, uh, okay. Yeah, go get your own car, man. Yeah, I'll have this one. Finders, keepers, losers, weepers, am I right? I mean, I guess, as long as it's not my car, man. That guy's a little weird, man. He tried taking my car, man. He's following me. Maybe I should snitch on that guy. I, mean, I don't even know his name, so I'm not gonna snitch. I mean, but it's just weird. He just stole a car. Why am I door shutting, man? There we go. It's locked my car. I don't want that sketchy guy coming around trying to grab it. What's going on? Is there, is there people in my house? Like, I don't know. It sounds like there's fighting going on. God, I, I didn't notice that the last time I was here. My dad broke my TV. Ah, oh, come on, dad. But yeah, it's one of these doors. Let me grab it.
Hey. What's going on? I was wondering if you had any weed. Nah, I mean, I mean, I mean, I found a joint, but I'm, 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 a, I'm gonna go smoke it myself. Oh. It's, it, it's like a pinner. It's not much, probably like a few hits. I see how it is. I mean, if I had any, man. I mean, I know a buddy that's got some. He's gonna hit me up in a minute. If you meet me back here in like ten minutes, I could sell you a few joints. Okay, I'll be here. Just tw uh, twenty or me out, you know. All right, sounds good, man. We're gonna go drive around. I got this joint. We're gonna go find a place to smoke it. I mean, I I I knew a lot of places in LAC, but we're not in LAC anymore, man. We moved. Uh, I think that was that guy looking for weed, man. I gotta be careful driving now. I gotta join on me, man. Go try to find a place to smoke it at. Normally there's like cool buildings I used to find and whatnot. And I go smoke it and whatnot. We'll go drive around and see if we, see, see if we, see if we find a place to smoke, you know I man. I gotta wait for my, uh, my friend to hit me up by message him. When I went back in the house after the guy had showed up and I had messaged him. He said he'll hit me up when he's got it. He'll give me a ring-a-ding-ding, -ding, you know what I mean? I just gotta be careful. I can't find no Chrysler 300. It, it, that's the Junty officer. He, he's trying to drive around to find me. What's going on, man? Oh, what's going on? Hopefully the school didn't call it in, man. Oh no. Oh no, there's two of them. Oh, you get scared, man. About turn the vehicle off for me. What's going on, man? Turn the vehicle off. All right, yeah, you get, give me, give me a second, man. Nope, wrong button. About the same geometry, turn the vehicle off. I mean, I'm trying, man. Uh, the, the, Try a little bit harder. The, turn the, the vehicle off. The, the key's wobbling, man. Here, do me a favor, just exit the vehicle. Okay, okay, I'll exit. Walk back to that black vehicle behind you. Okay, man. What's going on, man? Put your hands on the vehicle. Okay. Got anything on you that'll poke me, stick me, stab me? Okay, I'm, I'm, I'm not gonna lie to you. I, I got one joint in my in my left pocket. Alright, why are we getting that one call saying that you're not showing up to school?
I mean, I, I don't know. I, I, just, I just got, I mean, I just walked out to the parking lot, got my car, and left. It's boring there, man. Hold on. So you're saying you'd rather skip school than go get an education? Wait, I mean, my dad didn't go to school. I, I want you to confirm me. You'd rather skip school than get an education? I mean... I, I mean, I, it's a yes or no question, not a e i o u. Okay, I mean, no. To be honest with you. Okay, turn around and take a seat. Okay. You gonna learn your stuff on this evening? Sit down. Don't stand up. Don't move. What's going on today? Well, I mean, I just left school, man. Okay, huh? Is there a reason why you left? It's boring. Besides, it's boring. Nobody likes school. I know. So you left school, and where'd you go? Uh, I went to a buddy's house. And, well, I actually went home and I picked up some. I picked up the latch on their head. Where'd you get the weight? Well, I mean, I mean, I only had one joint. It was at home. I hid it on my mom, and I went back, and it was there. And I picked it up, and I was gonna go find a place to smoke it. Where are you buying weed from? Oh, this guy at school I go to, man. He sells weed to me. What's the school name? Uh, his his name is G Jimmy Jimmy Steves. But sometimes he goes by Steve Jimmy. I mean, I think his real name is Steve Jimmy, but he tells me it's Jimmy Steve. Okay, you got two options right now. All right. You can either go to the hospital, get sober up there, or you can go to jail. I, I don't want to go to jail, man. I, I, I'll go to the hospital. Okay. Now, I want to let you know. Marijuana is illegal. Alright, I want you to say it with me. Marijuana is illegal. Marijuana is illegal. Alright. I'm going to tell you how your next six months are going to look. Since you're not even old enough to technically purchase marijuana actually hold on <laughs> uh, I hope I don't go to jail what's your name buddy uh, Mickey uh, Flowers Jr. Yeah, here, here's what's going to happen. Yeah, what's that? So, seeing that you got until tomorrow, until you turn 18, what's going to happen is for the next six months, you're going to be on parole. Oh, All man. Right. I can tell you short term, you're going to be getting a summons for possession of a controlled substance. So, am I going to jail? You're going to get a summons. You're going to be released on a summons. You're going to come back to a judge 
later next month. He's gonna want you know if you're gonna be on a book to the system or you're gonna have to be on parole. It's more likely gonna be parole. I'm gonna push for parole. Okay. You're gonna have to check in with me every week. You're gonna piss in a cup. If you pop for any type of narcotic, you're going to jail right there on the spot. Alright, yeah, I don't want to go to jail, man. I'm gonna quit. Also, with him being on parole, he can't associate with anyone who is a felon. Right. Well, that means I can't associate with my dad. He's a felon. Uh, uh, your family your family is exempt. Your direct family is exempt. Oh, okay. But here's the thing. You get any tickets. You get any trouble in any run-ins with the law. You will be going to jail. Okay. Hey, I don't, I don't want to go to jail, man. Stay clean for a year, and you won't go to jail. It's I promise you it's not that hard. Okay, yeah, I'm gonna stay clean, man. I don't wanna go to jail. Stand up. Alright. I didn't anybody that can get your vehicle. Uh, I mean, my mom can come pick it up, but she's at work. She gets off in like 10 minutes. The keys are still in there? Yeah, the keys are still in there. Alright, I'm gonna move it up to their gas station right there and I'm gonna lock it up. Alrighty, man, I appreciate that. I uh, really, uh, my mom's not gonna be happy, man. Scary man. Uh, I'm scared, man. My mom's gonna find out everything, man. Oh uh, no. My mom's gonna be upset about this, man. Yeah, your mom's gonna be pissed. She is. You're, you're not going home tonight. You're going straight to the hospital. But what I can tell you is, this is better than the alternative. Yeah, I'll do anything. I don't want to go to jail, man. I'm, I'm really sorry. You got a job? Yeah, I work at the the pet store out there in Harmony, man. When do you go on to work next? Uh, I'm off for two more days. Here's what we're gonna do. You're, uh, you, you gotta keep that job, all right? Okay. Parole is gonna be very strict and it's gonna be very tough on you. Any failing, any type of anything that violates parole, straight to jail. Oh yeah, I, I don't, I don't want that to happen. Yeah, my dad goes to jail a lot, and my mom told me I needed to quit, like, so apparently she's getting a divorce with him, and I guess she threw him off the bridge the other day. Ah, uh, I did not hear about that. Yeah, and the cops showed up at her house, but they let her go and whatnot, I guess it was self-defense. Apparently he pulled a gun out on her and whatnot. I guess they're looking for him, I don't know. 
I mean, I don't associate with him. She doesn't let me. All right, we're gonna say this is the hospital. There's now one in Sussex. All right, walk around there to the front. Let them know what you're here for. I right. come and check on you in the morning. Alrighty, man. If you're not here, that's a warrant. All right, man. I'll be here, man. Oh man, my mom's not gonna be happy about this, man. Officer told me to come here. I gotta detox myself. I was smoking weed, man. Just take down, take a seat. All right, I'll take a seat. Alrighty, ladies and gentlemen, as you hear those gunshots off in the distance in the background, he told me to come here inside of the none other than the firehouse. I had to sober myself and whatnot up. And basically, I got a warrant. Well, not a warrant. I got, uh, I'm on probation, which is basically I can't get into trouble. I can't break any laws. I can't get any tickets. I can't, uh, smoke any more weed. I gotta take piss tests. My mom's at work. She probably got the car from the school. She's probably pissed. She probably got the car from the cops. Probably pissed. So, yeah, th this is not good, ladies and gentlemen. This is not good. My mom is gonna be pissed. I'm upset. I'm scared. I don't know what's going to happen. But I can tell you this. Uh, I'm going to try to better myself. I don't want to end up like my dad because apparently she got into a fight with him and she threw him off a bridge or whatnot, but he's always going to jail. And I, I don't know. I don't know. But we'll see what happens because apparently she threw him off a bridge and we'll, we'll, we'll just see what happens. Indeed we will, ladies and gentlemen. But until next time, ladies and gentlemen, thanks for watching WISRP, Wisconsin State Roleplay. That was Mickey Sticky Flowers Jr., the son of Mickey Sticky Flowers Sr., and his mom, another than Mona Flowers. And yeah, so he got arrested, almost, almost, but he got pulled over and got detained. It's scared and freaked him out and now he's on prob and now he's on probation so other than that ladies and gentlemen um yeah we'll see what happens in the future because i will bring mickey jr back out and get mona back out in the future and she's going to be really pissed at mickey jr but the story and the 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 story of mickey senior and mona and the fight and the divorce that's all going to continue on and it's going to break the family up eventually and Mickey Jr. is going to have to choose a side. Does he want to choose the path of being a criminal? Which he's kind of already going down that path, ditching school and doing this and that, you know, smoking weed and, you know, so, I mean, it's only going to get worse. Or is he going to listen to his mom and be the good path and work a job, not go to jail, although she almost went to jail throwing him off a bridge, but it was self-defense from what the cops say. I mean, yeah, so, got thrown off a bridge, he did, so, I mean, I could choose his path, be a criminal, be a low life, or I could choose my mom's path. I don't know how the story's gonna go out, but the story's already looking pretty good for so far. You're gonna see part one, which you already seen, which was dropped on Wednesday. This, uh, video drops, which is today, which, if you're watching it, on this day which is Friday if not then you're watching another day but I dropped it on Friday so basically part one came out on Wednesday and then other than uh, this video came out on Friday and then part three will come out on the next Wednesday so we'll see what happens until then ladies and gentlemen thanks for watching this episode of Mickey Sticky Jr. getting into some trouble at W I S R P with Cousin State Roleplay until next time, ladies and gentlemen, thanks for watching.